All right, Colby, a big win against Mid America today. Uh, kind of a slow first half, 26 points, and then you guys came back with 40 points in the second half. What was clicking offensively for you guys in the second half compared to the first? Uh, I don't think it was really like clicking. Like first half, we're getting the same shots. It's just second half, we just stepped up and hit them, and we got guys that are in the gym like all the time. So like, it's just getting up there and making the shot. Like we know where they can do it, so we just got confidence. They're gonna shoot it every time. Even if they miss in the first half, then they're gonna go in the second half. You guys are kind of rolling here early in conference play. How much confidence do you guys have as a team? Uh, enormous confidence. Like we're really deep. We got a lot of guys that can come in and contribute, and uh, we all shoot the ball really well. And it's just fun out there playing with them. Okay, hey coach, a big win against a ranked MNU team today. Uh, you held them 23 points below their season average. What did you think of your defense? Uh, I thought that our defense was tough today and resilient. I mean, this was two tired teams really going at it, especially down the stretch, and I thought that we um, got two things out of it. Um, some real mental toughness, fighting through fatigue out of everybody, and we got a lot of great play from our bench defensively. You know, Saxon Thuston comes to mind, doing a great job on Green, who's an awesome player, an all-conference player. Chris Jackson in there, Wills Walrat, Jaden Temme, all giving us great minutes on both ends, but defensively, um, the second half, we did a good job of wearing them out. Um, definitely our depth was there, and I liked our physicality around the rim. You know, we got a chance to contest um, when they were close. We blocked some shots. We did a great job of getting our hands on rebounds. I mean, it was ugly out there at times and a little sloppy, but you have to you have to try to find a way to get through that adversity and not feel sloppy and not feel ugly and just keep grinding. And I thought our guys did a good job of that. Jaden Bristol had eight assists, and he's had a lot of assists in all your games so far. How far has he come here in his second year in the program? I mean, I think part of those assists is the fact that he's also a little bit more of a threat offensively to score himself, you know, by getting to the rim and he's made some threes and he can do some different things. He hit a little floater in there, you know, in the second half. So that opens up. They have to help on him. And his vision has always been there. Um, there's a maturity level that's a little better now than, than there was as a freshman, and that's just a minutes thing. The more minutes he gets, and he's trusting his teammates. Um, but, you know, he's fast. He does a great job of finding people. And it's not always off ball screens, you know. Sometimes it's just getting getting into a gap or getting downhill and uh, creates for his teammates, and it makes some easy shots.